Good morning, my dear student. How are you all? I hope you are all well by the grace of Almighty. I'm also well, my dear student. This is Kosu Zaman from Marston Preparatory KZ School before you. Today, I'm going to take your English. My dear student, can you tell me what was your previous lesson? Yes, your previous lesson was make sentence and rhymes, names of the month. So, my dear student, who can tell me the rhymes? Yes, my dear student, the rhyme says there are 30 days in September, April, June, and November. All the rest have 31, not February. It's a different one. It has 28, that's fine. A leap year makes it 29. Thank you, my dear student, for learning your previous lesson. Okay, my dear student. Now, today's lesson. Today's lesson is EFT unit 25 to 28, page 50 to 57. What meaning? Make sentence, page 57, activity B and C. So my dear student, before going to the today's lesson, we learn <coughs> what will be the learning outcome of today's lesson. Yes, my dear student, at the end of the lesson, student will be able to read the text and extract information reading. Say the meaning of the words, listening and speaking. Make sentences and answer the question from the text. So my dear student, I'll tell you, be very attentive towards the class, my dear student. Now, you can see, you need 25. What can you see? Yes, you can see some animals. And what sounds do they make? My dear student, here A, you can see, listen and say. Here, what is this? Cat, a cat mews. Biral? Mew mew daki. A frog croaks. Bang. Croak croak daki. A crow calls. Kak kaka daki. A duck quacks. Hush peck peck daki. A dog barks. Kukur. Ghew ghew kare. A got blades. Sagol bhev hai kare. Ami abar bolsi. A cat mews. Bidal mew mew kare. A frog cracks. Bang. Ghangur ghang. Ba crock crock kare. A Pro coach. Kak, ka ka kore. A duck quacks. Hush, pep pep kore. A dog barks. Kuku, ghew ghew kore. A goat bleeds. Sagul, bhab bhab kore. My dear student, now mess with the word of left side with the meaning of the right side. So here you can see dog, match, yes, bark. What does the dog make sound? Bark. Cat, mew. Crow, caw. Got, bleeds. Duck, quack, frog, 
क्रक आर बोलते डग बाघ खैट मेउ क्र क गट ब्लीच डाक क्वाक फ्रग क्रक सुमा स्टूडेंट नाउ गो टू द नेक्स्ट पेज what sound do they make here you can see a hen a hen clucks so my dear student murgi kok kok kare a hen clucks a horse neighs ghoda resha dhoni kare a horse neighs ghoda resha dhoni kare a lion roars singho garjan kare a tiger growls bag halum halum kare a cow moos goru hamba hamba kore dake a cow moos goru हम्बा हम्बा कोरे डाके आ पिजन खुज पायरा बा कबूतर बाग बाकुम कोरे डाके आ पिजन खुज कबूतर बाग बाकुम कोरे डाके सो माय डियर स्टूडेंट फेयर वर्क पॉइंट एंड से द एनिमल और द साउंड Pigeon. Here you can see. Say the sound. Coos. Here you can see. Moose. Dog. Tiger. Grouse. Crook. Frog. Cat. Mew. Roar. Lion. Dog. bark clack duck horse neigh quack dart sorry my dear student this is clack clack this will be hen quack dart goat bleat Ha, a crow. So my dear student, go to the next page. Here you can see, join the dots and say the missing numbers. In the previous class, already you have done this. So next, go to the play next page. What are the? What are they doing? Here you can see some pictures here. Listen and say, what are you doing? In the pictures, the boy is calling someone. So, what are you doing? He is telling. And the girl is telling, I am doing homework. Balikti bol se tumi ki korcho? Meti bol te se. I'm doing homework. I'm in Bari Kajkochi. This girl is telling, What are you doing? To me, ki kurso. This boy is telling, I'm watching TV. Listen and say, I'm reading. I'm in Boy Kurchi. I'm in Porchi. I'm coloring. I'm in Ron Kurchi. I'm eating. I'm in Kachi. I'm getting up. जेगे उठसी 
V1 plus ING. So, ekhane, all the sentences are in the present continuous tense. Okay? Again, I'm telling, what are you doing? Tumi ki korso? The girl is telling, I'm doing homework. Ami barir kat kochi. This girl is, is telling, what are you doing? Tumi ki korso? The boy is telling, I'm watching TV. Ami TV dekchi. B. This girl is saying, I'm reading. Ami purchi. I'm coloring. Ami wrong korchi. I'm eating. Ami khachi. I'm getting up. Ami ghumthi ke jeke utsi. I'm drawing. Ami wrong korchi. I'm drawing. Ami akchi. I'm writing. Ami likchi. What are they doing? What can you see in this picture? They are, my dear student, this is short form of they are, okay? They are planting seeds. Tara, beach, ropon korteche. Present continuous tense, subject plus amateur plus main verb plus ing plus object. They are watering plants. Tara, charagas. Taragache pani diche. They are watering plants. They are planting seeds. Tara beach rupon korche. They are watering plants. Tara taragache pani diche. They are washing their hands. Tara tade had duche. They are washing their hands. Tara tade had duche. They are eating oranges. Tara. Komla libukache. They are eating oranges. Tara komla libukache. Water. What am I doing? You are drinking water. Okay. The girl is telling that. What am I doing? I mean, kikuchi. Tara she bondeche. You are drinking water. To me, pani pan korcho. Okay, my dear student. These are the numbers. From 11 to 20, already you have practiced these numbers. So next, go to the next page. Here you can see the story, my dear student. This is the story, the cow and the frog. The cow and the frog. Guru Ebong Bang. Listen and read. The cow is eating grass. Goruti ghash The frog is sitting on the grass. Bangti ghashi rupur The frog is looks at the cow and things. Bangti Bangti Goruti dikhe taka ibong bhabe. The cow is big. Goruti boro. I want to be big. Ami borohuti jai. So the frog ate some grass. Tai Bangti kisughash kai. The frog grows bigger. Bangti kisuta borohoi. The cow looks at the frog and thinks, Guruti bangit dikitakai ebong habe. How strange. Ki The frog is eating grass. Bangti ghash The frog is happy. Bangti khushi hai. The frog eats more grass. Bangti aru ghash khai. The cow is not eating grass now. Akunar guruti ghash khat The cow thinks guruti bhabe how strange ki Output. The cow is flying away. Sorry, the frog is flying away. Bangti urita che. So, my dear student, we read the story, but now we will write the answer of these questions. Okay? So, here you can see five questions here. So, let's go to the next slide. Uh, 
and here and here here you can see b and the student first question is which animal is big and which animal wants to be so my dear student can you tell me what will be the answer yes in the passage we have read that which animal is big the cow is big and which animal wants to be yes the fox wants to be big isn't it yes second one what does the cow say straight why does why does the cow say straight kano kano goruti bole adbhut yes the cow says strange to see the frog eating grass and then flying away in the passage we have seen that the cow says strange to see the frog eating grass and then flying away the cow says strange to see the frog eating grass and then flying away next why does the frog grow bigger who can tell me what will be the answer yes my dear student in the passage we have read that the frog grows bigger for eating grass the frog yes here yeah, the frog grows bigger for eating grass okay the next what does the cow think yes what will be the answer the cow thinks it is very strange that the frog is flying away yeah you can see the cow thinks it is very strange that the frog is flying away fifth one what happens to the frog at the end of the story yes my dear student can you tell me what will be the answer in the passage we have seen, seen that at the end of the story the frog grows much bigger and then flies away here you can see at the end of the story the frog frog grows much bigger and flies away thank you my dear student now we'll do some word meaning okay my dear student we'll learn some word meaning okay here you can see write the meaning of the following words my dear student second one uh, so, sorry first one mew mew means mew mew kara in english meaning to make the sound that a cat makes quack quack means peck peck kara yes to make the sound that a duck makes peck peck kara to make the sound that a duck makes bleat bha bha kara to make the sound that a goat makes have has of the kora to make the sound that a goat makes then ka 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 kora to make the sound that a crow makes ka ka kora to make the sound that a crow makes bark kheu kheu kora to make the sound that a dog makes to make the sound that a dog makes then croak 
ক্রক মিন্স ব্যাঙ্গের শব্দ ক্রক ক্রক করা টু মেক দ্য সাউন্ড দ্যাট আ ফ্রগ মেক্স প্লান্ট প্লান্ট মিন্স রোপণ করা টু পুট সিডলিং ইন দ্য গ্রাউন্ড টু গ্রো ক্লাক ক্লাক মিন্স কক কক করা that means to make the sound that a hen makes nay nay means threshadhani kara to make the sound that a horse make then roar gorjon kara to make the sound that a lion makes then who who means bagbakum kara to make the sound that a pigeon makes then moo then hambara bedaka to make the sound that a cow makes then growl growl means halum halum kara to make the sound that a tiger makes point point means nitish kara to state your finger to something to state your finger to something need this kara to state your finger to something okay my dear student then strange strange means he odd for something odd or unfamiliar then away uh, means dure at a distance from somebody or something happen happen means ghata that means to take place end and means shesh the final part of something again again means abar one more time then title shironam caption then want want means java to have a desire for something strange odd something odd or unfamiliar away dure at a distance from somebody or something happen khata to take place and shesh the final part of something again abar one more time title shironam caption want chawa to have a desire for something okay my dear student now we will learn some make sentence okay so my dear student here you can see homework who can make sentence with homework yes you can tell i am doing my homework I have done my homework, okay? Second one, listen, listen to me. Then, people, I've seen many people. There are many people on the road. Any sentence you can write. Plants, okay, Rupun Kora or Taragas. We are watering the plants. Then, seeds. they are planting seeds more the frog ate more grass homework i'm doing my homework listen listen to me people there are many people on the road plants we are watering the plants seed they are planting seeds more the frog ate more grass away they are running away away they are running away grass the cow is eating grass grass the cow is eating grass title what is the title of the story title what is the title of the story happen what happened there what is happening there happen what is happening there again do the sum again do the sum again strange a strange man k 
came to Aladdin. A strange man came to Aladdin. Animal. We should love animals. Animal. We should love animals. Grow. We grow different kinds of vegetables. We grow different kinds of vegetables. Grass. The cow is eating grass. Grass. The cow is eating grass. Want. What do you want? What do you want? End. The end of the story is interesting. The end of the story was interesting. End. The end of the story was interesting. Then thing. What are you thinking? What does the cow think? What does the cow think? Fly. The frog flies away. Fly. The frog flies away. Then, happy. I'm happy. The frog was happy. The frog was happy. Sit. My friend sits beside me. My friend sits beside me. My dear student, in feedback, I'll ask you, okay? So, read and match the word. Yes, my dear student, match with the word of the left side, with the word of the right side. So, match. Dog. Okay, what will be the matching? Edge. Dog. Bugs. Cat. Who can tell me? Cat. Mew. Crow, 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 got, bleeds, duck, quack, frog, crow. Thank you, my dear student, for being attentive in the class. So, my dear student, your homework will be EFT. You need 25 to 28, page 50 to 57. You will learn what meaning makes sentence. And from page 57, you will learn activity B and C, learn. And learn and write activity B. Your homework number will be 29. So my dear student, you will do your homework properly and correctly and submit it to the concerned teacher. Okay? Thank you. My dear student, now we are at the last session of the class. I've given the homework. You will do the homework correctly and properly and submit it to the concerned teacher. Okay? In the next class, see you. Allah Hafiz.